What is up ladies and gentlemen, my name is Loverfella and welcome back to Planet Coaster. Last time we left off basically working on kind of trying to make some more money for the park. I made a roller coaster that was a total fail, didn't work at all, and then I started to look at my park from kind of like a uh, unbiased perspective. And I realized I had this really weird design thing going on right now where my buildings are kind of just jutting out of the side of these spirals. Oops, I kind of like locking it to daytime just while I'm building and kind of talking about it. But my, my buildings are just kind of randomly jutting out. Isn't that kind of weird? Like when you go to a park, you don't really see it look like that necessarily. So I think what I want to do is base... Gosh, what is that? Man, I hate, I hate this song. If you play this game... You're gonna hate this song so much. It put there we go. It just it kills me. Okay, so I want to make this more realistic. In order to do that, that means I need to make like actual dining areas. So how do I keep the organic flow while still keeping a dining area theme? I'm trying to think that through, and maybe I'll go with something. Uh oh, it broke. That's okay. I'm thinking we'll go with like a nice little squiggly doodle right here, something like that. Maybe like a triple squiggle. Make it like a little serpent or something. And then I'd like to line this with a bunch of food things, okay? So, is it possible to move these, or do I have to sell it? Mmm, that means I have to sell all my sprinklers up here. Oh well, is what it is. You're out of here, son. This is how people get fired in real life. This is how you get- How do I fire you? How do I fire you? Get out of here. Select building. Select vendor. Where's the fire button? I can close it. Ooh, look at that. Look at this, look at this. This is crazy. I close it. She stays in there. I open it. She's still in there. Close it. She's, she doesn't go home. That's where she sleeps, but you guys didn't know that. Okay, but for real, there should be like a bulldozer button. All right, I just went with the old-fashioned delete key on the keyboard. And let's go to custom. I would like to get a new balloon building. Looney balloons? Yeah, let's get a new balloon building. And see, it's going to look a lot better over here, like an actual designated area. I'm going to add a picnic area in here. It's going to look really good. So, balloon area. Well, I was messing with that. Yeah, it looks fine. It looks fine. I realize you can change balloon prices, so why would you price balloons differently? I'm not sure, but I guess we'll make red lowest because we want people to use red balloons. So we'll make red four. Orange is okay. Green. We don't want any. We don't want any yellow in our park. That's gonna clash too much of the reds. So yellow balloons are 100, 250. Is that the most? Okay, yellow balloons are 250 dollars. So if we see someone with a yellow balloon, we know they're a baller, and we gotta follow them around <laughs> and give them a bunch of stuff to buy. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and deck these out in a bit. Our vendor quit? Good. We don't want you anyway. Get out of here. Okay. Now we need a food shop. Hot dogs. Chef beef. I don't even know what that one is. Fruit frites and tiki chicka chicka. We'll go with this one based solely on the awesome sounding name. And where do we want this? Opposite side, I think. Maybe like right... Right there. That looks pretty cool. Yeah, it looks good. Oh gosh, that was a weird noise. Did you guys hear that? Did that come through? I hope so. Prices. What do we have here? Spicy chicken. Oh, <laughs> what? I can chart... Oh, I can figure out how they give extras. That's so unnecessary. Spicy chicken for nine bucks. Jeez, that's expensive. I'm not about to charge people. Sorry, not five hundred dollars. Spicy chicken's a five, no, five dollars for spicy chicken. We'll come with extra mayonnaise. I'll tell you that right now. Extra ketchup. Mayonnaise and ketchup mix pretty well, and a little mustard. A little mustard goes a long way. As for plain chicken, that's going to come with nothing because you guys are obviously don't like your toppings. That's going to be four dollars. Coconut chicken. Um, that's pretty exotic. I just think I'd just go for $12 and put a little chili s Ew, no. And then we have hot wings. Nine bucks for hot wings. That's gonna come with a little bit of chili sauce, a little bit of mustard, mayonnaise, and ketchup. You never know what you get. It's a little, a little bit of everything. And finally, we're gonna tame the name from Tiki Cheeky to Get Yo Food Girl. Yeah, that's good. Probably. That'll sell. <clears throat> Moving on. We are going to build one more shop, and they need to get a little drink shop in here. So coffee, slushy, energy, or a milkshake. They don't seem to give you very many healthy options, do they? Well, slushy it is. And this one, I kind of don't want to put it in the center, so we'll put it right on the top. No, no, no. We'll put it over here on this side. Right about like that. Okay, you look good. We'll have to add some details later. Pink slush, blue slush, orange, and green. Ice, it's going to come with a lot of ice, because if you add a lot of ice, you're giving them less slushy, you're kind of, you know, you see what I'm saying, we're ripping them off a little bit. All of you are coming with extra ice because we're trying to save money here. If I give you more ice, I give you less of the actual stuff. Yes, come, consume. Alright, as for scenery, this is pirate area, so we need some pirate benches. And, let's see, how do I want to do this? I'm going to add a bench, hmm, one there, and one there, along with some pirate trash cans. What we'll a pirate trash can next to both of these buildings. Jeez, love her sanity you keep on breaking, man. Come on, baby. 
What's wrong with you? We need to get you, uh, where, where is this? Maintenance. We need to get you a little inspection going on. Jeez. 1900 bucks to fix that crap. Okay. Scenery. We got that taken care of. I think a little bit of nature, you know? You want some trees around here. Some good quality trees. Like a floral creeper. See? That looks good. One there. I want it organic, so I'm just kind of probably disperse some a little bit. And I want a big one in the center. A big honker. Yeah! That's what I like right there. Right there. Just like that. I feel like Bob Ross right now. Okay. That's looking good. Let's go into more scenery. Got a few more. Give me some plants. Oops. Let's get down a little bit. There we go. Let's go into the bushes. I want a nice, pretty looking bush. Like that guy. That's pretty. Oh, yeah. That looks good. Okay. Red floral bush. Um, does that really fit what we have going on? No, that's not really... I'm not feeling that one. Maybe... No, I'm not feeling that one either. This one? Nope. I think I'm feeling just more of the green kind of for this one. Maybe like right next to that tree on either side. Brings that together a little bit. And then... A little tiny rock. That's a big rock. That's also a big rock. Where, where are the small ones? There we go. What a nice small rock right there. And... We'll add, what do we got? A little prop. What a nice prop in here to kind of pull it together. A barrel planter as you walk in to the food section. Let's make sure we line this up correctly right here. Oh my gosh. This is just, this is just the best looking thing I've ever seen. That was a weird voice that just came out of my body. Alrighty. Got a, whatever this thing is. A dragon, a big pile of poop. No, I feel like that's not good for a food section, personally. I really just, a fruity cargo. There we go. Well, that's some fruity cargo right here, kind of around that rock. Okay, so that's really, I mean, that honestly looks pretty decent. Got to put something over here. I don't want anything weird. Like, I'm trying to make this a seriously good park. <gasps> Obviously, we got to put a bench right here, dude. Come on, we cannot just put an area like this without benches. And I can put a bench actually right there. Look at that. Is there a campfire? Because this looks like an area you'd be going camping at. You know what I'm saying? Let's get rid of this guy. And let's get rid of this guy. Oh, let's get rid of this guy. <laughs> I just deleted everything. I just want one in the middle. I like it there. It's kind of weird how the bench just snapped, but that looks really, really nice. Okay. Looks like the bench kind of snapped to the other bench, and that's how I got it to kind of go off path like that. If you were wondering, Ben's bench is all that taken care of. One more prop, an anvil. For some I don't know why, honestly, but that just really looks good right there. I'm feeling that. And an anchor. I need an anchor. This is a boat area, man. We've got to get an anchor. Right? Where do we want this anchor at? We'll put this anchor. Hmm, this is this is tough. It goes right here. That's a good anchor spot. I don't care who you are. That's a good anchor spot. So you see, this makes a lot more sense as a food area. It's a designated food area. I want to get all the crap out of here. Like, what what is this? Why did I build this here? Gone. You're fired. Just like real life. Get out of here. I don't care about you people. Now turn this music off, man. I feel like the Grinch right now, but I can't take it. Where's the where's the music? Rapturous rock. How about no music? Okay. So, this actually looks pretty cool. Um, I'm trying to get, like, really customizable with my buildings and stuff. So, what is this? Ooh, I like that music you got going on, mister. Okay. I need to customize it. So, it's a balloon shop. Let's give it a giant balloon. Is there, is there anything, like, skinnier, though? I mean, like, skinny and tall? I'm trying to, like, not build, like, a giant freaking disgusting... I mean, might as well just go all out, you know what I'm saying? You want a balloon? We got... <laughs> <laughs> Let's make it, I don't know. This is a good balloon size, I think. And what a balloon string would be white. So we'll make that one white. And then a balloon shape. Is it like, is this a balloon shape? Not really, particularly, no. I mean, that honestly really doesn't look like a balloon in any way. But I think it's because this thing's just too fat. Yeah. We got any skinnier balloon stands looking things? That's definitely not going to work. It's just, it's not here. There's just no... Duplicate advanced mode, split from building, duplicate. I just don't think, I think we're gonna have to make a do with what we have. So maybe we get a unique shaped balloon like this. It's too big. I can't do it. I can't do it. It's too big. We gotta go smaller. A little baby balloon. And we're not even gonna put it on the roof. I'm too much of a baby. We're gonna put a little baby. No, we are. We are. I'm so indecisive. We're gonna put a balloon right there. We'll give it a nice, nice little circle right on top, just like that. It looks like nothing like a balloon. Make it a nice white color. Sorry about that. Hangouts. Forgot to close it again. Now, this is the, this is going to be, I don't know, control Z, I, I got to re-put the ball on. Okay, here's the deal, I keep, okay, the problem is I'm placing it, and then it's snapping to the building, and then it's just, it's a mess. Place that, before it snaps, we change the color, then it's part of the building. Now, we place, get out of there, get out of there, 
Scenery, I don't know what I'm doing, guys. You know that. Let's get a... Oh, that's a big balloon. That's a little bit too much for me. Little baby balloon, just like that. We're going to change the color to yellow, because yellow is the balloon everyone wants to get. And then maybe we could add, like, a... You know, a little, little something. Like, a, something that looks like a balloon. Like a special effect. Like blowing dirt. Or electric sparks or something like that. Something that says... I'm a balloon. Yeah. And let's put it in the balloon. So it's classy. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? There we go. That is totally not centered at all. Let's get that advanced move in here. A little bit that way. A little bit like that. And that is about as centered as somewhat. What? It didn't move. It didn't move. Let's go this way a little bit. Let's go a little bit like that. Okay. Done. That is why I call. It's not. What what am I doing? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna have to Alright, that's the balloon. You know what? I don't even care. That's all I can do right now. <laughs> I wanted to be good at this game. I wanted to be the best. And that's all I can do. Alright, well, that's about that's about oh no, I'm not trying to pause it right now. Okay, we'll decorate these later. I gotta like watch other people. Like what do other people do that are good at this game? Building decoration I feel like I suck at, but actual path decoration I feel like I'm not too bad at. So I like the nature a lot, honestly, I guess you guys can tell, because I do a lot with it. I like the bushes, I like covering up buildings with bushes, I like covering paths with bushes, because that's what real parks do, you know? They have bushes and they have a lot of fences. Ooh, I do like the feel of that. Let's rotate a little bit. Right? No, maybe I don't. Maybe I want to just keep it, keep it all the same. I'm not sure. I'm just not sure. Actually, that looks really good right there. A nice big one, a nice winding path into all the food. This thing looks like crap. It took me so long to make. We're keeping it. That way we know it's the balloon store. And that way, if we see anyone with yellow balloon, we're like, dude's rich AF. We know it. Ooh. She has to listen to that all day. Look how sad she is. She just keeps looking down. She's like, I hate my life. I literally hate. I want to kill myself. Please, God, kill me. Look at her. I close it. She keeps listening to it in there. You can hear it. There she is. <laughs> Alright, so that is a lot better organization of a food section. It's much more organic. It really doesn't match the rest of my park, so I've got to kind of amp up the rest of my park a little bit. Let's add some more trees around the perimeter of this. I just think they really bring it together really nicely. If you hear a really loud squeaking noise, that's just my uh, air furnace or like heater thing turned on right now. I don't know why it does that, but it just does. We'll have the bathroom right here at the end of this bad boy. And I'd like to add one more building, not first aid. What is this, park entrance gate? Dude, I should totally add a park entrance gate and be like, you guys have to pay to come here. <laughs> pay to get your food, then you can pay to get more food. We're going to add one more gift shop right there. Let's see what this guy sells. Snow globe, crystal ball, and sci-fi radio. Those seem like fair prices. We're just going to make the crystal ball a lot cheaper because I'd like to have a bunch of crazy people with crystal balls walking around. So a dollar. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They want the crystal ball. You know they want it. Let's see it. Let's see. Are you guys going to get it? Slow down, slow down, pause the game. Did you get the crystal ball? What the heck is that? That looks like a turkey leg. They just bought a turkey leg from... Uh, what? They all five bought turkey legs. That's fascinating. This guy must have some kind of unrecovered job going on in here. What you got in here? Clearly you're not selling snow globe crystal balls and sci-fi radios. Let's slow it down and see. Are they like going to talk? No, they're definitely eating. That guy's selling turkeys. I got to fire him real quick. I don't know about that, man. Um, yeah, sorry. Had to do it. New one's back. He looks pretty similar to the last. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, she looks more trustworthy. Got that taken care of, I think. This is beautiful. This is such a good looking design. Park's going well over here. How's our money doing? I haven't been watching it. We're up to $900. Really not making too much money. Could be from bad management decisions, like making snow globes worth a dollar or whatever. I just put it a dollar. Let's get. Let's see, I want a little bit more scenery. We're going to add a nice little trash can over here. Because these people are a mess. And don't know how to throw their stuff away for some reason. So, that's nice and fun. Always nice to have messy people. Got this ATM right here. Doesn't really seem to fit in my opinion. How many people have used it? Um, zero people. Goodbye. I think. Goodbye. Get out of here. Uh, it's not It's not letting me delete it. I'm not sure what's going on with that. But... This area looks nice. Looks like a real park. The other areas of the park need redone. This whole front entrance needs completely overhauled, redesigned, and then turned into an actual entrance. Like, what is this? Get out of here. We don't want that. This thing's kind of messed up. That thing's just floating. Got a weird head. Like, that's going to turn people off in my park. I want them to come in and be like, yes, this is the greatest park ever. And what does that more than some water effects? You know what I'm saying? A little bit of, uh, 
A little bit of spurt and water right here to get you wet. No, that'd be annoying. I think we'll play it safe. We'll just go with some nature. Some nice grand entrance trees to welcome you inside. I like that a lot. It looks good. It looks classy. Not too much, but not too little. And then we're going to add... Go to Where's my bushes? Here we go. We're going to add some nice... Oopsies. We're going to add some nice colorful bushes. I think red roses. Oh, yeah. That says... This is a serious park. We need business. We have people who plant red flowers for you. Look at that. You walk in, greeted by this thing. Uh, you know what? This is a, not a good building right here. This whole building I'd like to get rid of. So we're going to just, you know, we're going to delete it. What have I done? Look at it. Oh my gosh. I thought it was scary before. I don't know how to delete things in this game. I thought it was just delete on my keyboard. That doesn't work. I don't see a delete button up here. So maybe there's like a, like a bulldozer or something somewhere. All right, I'm just gonna have to Google that, how to delete it, but wait a minute, didn't I have a ride here? How'd I delete that ride? Where'd it go? Oh man. Well, that's even creepier. We're gonna leave it there, figure out how I can actually delete things. And I wanna remove this whole row, turn it into an actual edible area, kind of like this more organized section, which could definitely use some more scenery and trees in the background, I think. Definitely not that guy. Yeah, these plants. I think I'm gonna surround it with these plants all the way around it. Just pull it together and make it private, you know? Like when you're eating, you don't want people staring at you. And I wish they had picnic tables, so maybe I'll download like a picnic table mod. That'd be pretty cool to have. But this area is pretty cool. I think it looks pretty nice, although the bathroom's probably pretty annoying to get to. But a smart design, you know what? They gotta walk through all the places. <gasps> Why aren't you open? Tearing a perfect temple. That's what he just said. What are they selling? Are you selling chickens too? Hopefully not, man. Hopefully not. Let's see what she just bought. She won't even show us what she just bought. It's undercover, man. She's hiding it. But I like that a lot. That area is really cool, and I'm going to have more like it, more organic shapes for this water area particularly. And how much room do I have? I have a lot of room. So I think water area will be the first section. I'll expand off to the right and make western area, expand off to the left, make more water area, and then up here might be a, like, there's like a witch theme. I can make a witch area, western, water, and they're all going to have different style roads, different style plants, different style everything, and it's going to be awesome. But what I want to keep working on is removing these buildings that just jut out from the side. That doesn't look good. That's not how real buildings are. They have like specific building areas, like maybe like an arc like this. Like this thing looks great, you know? I want an area like this that's like surrounded by buildings that look nice. So I've got to take care of that. But this park really is coming along a lot, and I'm pretty happy with how this thing looks over here. Um, let me know in the comments, you guys that are watching this episode, this series, if you'd like me to make progress off camera, or if you like when I do basically everything on camera. These episodes are longer than the ones I normally make, but it's a really fun game, and it's easy to just kind of do stuff the whole time. It's a lot of micromanaging. It's a lot of fun to play. So let me know what you guys think. If you have any comments, suggestions, critiques, this is a new series. So if there's something you want to see me do, let me know. I will gladly do it. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for supporting this new series. I love it so much. Like the people that watch the series, that watch anything I make, that those are the people that they just mean so much. Everyone means so much to me, but you guys mean especially a lot because you're willing to try out new games, especially games you may have not seen before. And it's just fantastic. So anyway, I'm going to call it a night here recorded a lot of videos today this is my like fourth one in a row so i can get them out for thanksgiving i love you guys more than anything and i will see you all tomorrow